Don't throw away overripe bananas. Here's an easy way to preserve them for your next recipe. Slice them into a quarter to a half inch thick rounds. Smaller chunks are perfect if you're planning on making smoothies or an acai bowl. To prevent them from sticking together during storage, place them on a parchment paper lined sheet pan. Freeze the slices for two hours or until they firm up. The bananas are solid. Now you can transfer them to a resealable bag or airtight container. Remove as much air as possible from the bag. This will prevent freezer burn. Seal it up. The slices can be stored up to three months in the freezer. And as you can see, they're not gonna stick together. You could also store the bananas whole in the freezer, peel off the skin. This is great if you plan on making chocolate dip bananas, or if you like larger pieces to make something like nice cream. Just cut it down the middle to make a half. Place on a parchment paper lined sheet pan and freeze until solid about two to three hours. Once they're solid, just transfer them to a bag and freeze for three months. If your bananas are overripe, but you're not ready to make banana bread just yet, you can mash them up. A medium banana yields about a half a cup of mashed fruit. It's the perfect portion size if you're adding it to other recipes. Transfer the puree to a small bag and make sure to label how much is inside. Or you could put it in a silicone ice cube tray and have these nice portioned out amounts of mashed banana. Now, if you honestly think that that's just too much work, you could seriously just grab a whole banana and pop it in the freezer. This is great if you're short on time, but you really don't want to waste a banana. Just put it in the freezer, take it out of the freezer about an hour or two before you're ready to use it, and then just peel away. To thaw the bananas, you can leave it at room temperature for 30 minutes up to two hours, or you could gently depress it in the microwave. For an even quicker method, you can just grab a bowl, place the bag of bananas in the bowl, and cover it with cold water. Let it defrost for about 10 minutes. Frozen bananas are a versatile ingredient to use in baking, in beverages, and for snacks. Here are some fun ways to use them. Who doesn't love a warm slice of banana bread? My kids absolutely love these chocolate chip banana muffins. Or for breakfast, pancakes or waffles. Add some bananas to a classic bread pudding. I always add them to smoothies like this peanut butter banana one. Or you can make acai bowls or nice cream. What's your favorite way to add them into recipes? Let me know in the comment section below. Make sure to check out my other videos for helpful ingredient tips. See you there.